Before you install any video editing software on your PC or laptop, make sure that your computer meets the minimum system requirements. This can save you a lot of frustration if the software doesn't work or perform as expected after installation. You'll thank me later. So for the purpose of this video, I'll be using three video editing applications as an example. CapCut, DaVinci Resolve, and ClipChamp. I know there are many other free tools to use, but I'll be using these three. Now that we got that out of the way, let's get to the video. So let's start with CapCut system requirements. So here we have a quick overview of the requirements. So for a Windows machine, these are the requirements. As for the operating system, Windows 10 or higher, the processor, Intel Core i3 or above, memory, four gigabytes of RAM or above, graphics card and storage space. And these are the requirements for a Mac computer. Also for the internet connection, you just need standard broadband connection. Check if your computer has or meet those requirements. Now, as for DaVinci Resolve here again, at a glance, operating system, Windows 10, Mac OS, Linux, these are the operating system. As for the processor, Intel Core i7 or AMD Ryzen 7 or higher, these are for the graphics card, the system memory, it's recommended um, at least 16 gigabytes, but for better performance, 32. For Blackmagic Design Desktop Video, these are the version that it is recommending and for the storage of fast solid state hard drive. Keep in mind that DaVinci Resolve is a powerful application for video editing. It demands a lot of system resources from your computer. So I believe that based on what we're seeing, the recommendations or the minimum system requirements are higher than the other applications, just because DaVinci Resolve has a lot more functionality and flexibility than the other free versions of video editing applications. So now let's take a look at ClipChamp. ClipChamp, these are the minimum system requirements uh, for the RAM, at least eight gigabytes of RAM, but 16 is recommended for the operating system, a 64 bit computer uh, for the browser. It recommends Microsoft Edge or Google Chrome and the graphics card, a, a recent model, free space, as much free space you could possibly have. It also, it says that ClipChamp is a video editing tool that can be used on desktop or laptop computers, including Chromebooks. It's not optimized for touchscreen devices like tablets or iPads. So keep that in mind. Don't install it on any of those devices. Also with ClipChamp, you can use it online. You can use the desktop version and also you can access it through Microsoft 365. Very important with ClipChamp is that you need an internet connection to use it, whether you're using the online version or the desktop application, you still need an internet connection. So this is the only uh, uh, drawback on this application. There was one time I was I wanted to use it, but as, as a test, I didn't uh, turn on the Wi-Fi on my laptop and I couldn't use it. So keep that in mind that with ClipChamp, you need an internet connection. And there you have it. The minimum system requirements for CapCut, DaVinci Resolve and ClipChamp, if you want to give it a try. Thank you for watching and be well. Mm -hmm.